Somehow that vibranium is working in reverse. Instead of absorbing vibrations, it's producing them. Let's hope I got this web shooter working right. I always think that Peter Parker works so well for so long because he is the most relatable superhero. You okay, Pete? You seem a little down. Just money troubles. As a middle-class kid from Queens, uh, he's got an Aunt May to take care of. He's had some real loss in his life. We have a whole new cast, and we went through an extensive casting process, particularly for Peter. The great thing about Pete is that he's someone that you can not only relate to, but look up to. I want to be like you. You're my hero. There's not one bad bone in Miles Morales. He's a young 15-year-old science nerd, but everyone loves him. You still haven't met Gwen Stacy, have you? Gwen Stacy? I have. I mean, I haven't. I mean, she's so smart. She can stand up next to him and, and have these amazing ideas. But you know you could have just created a web fan and made a wind cushion from a helicopter's air pressure, right? It's one of the things that I love about this show so much is that all of the students are so capable. What allows cellular devices to transmit without wires? Batteries? I'm shocked. Anya Corazon is Latin, and she is really kind of a tough girl. This time, at least have a better excuse. She's super smart, intellectual. She knows everything. I've been working on a retinal identification app. What I like about Harry is that even though he grew up privileged, and he's aware of that fact, he's still a loyal friend to Pete. Do you have to be so rude, Dad? And Pete's my best friend. And today, he's the competition. I play Norman Osborn. He's fabulously successful and wealthy. When it involves my son, I will move mountains if need be. Wouldn't that upset the organic balance of nature? Max Modell is a genius. He's well-versed in all parts of science. If Max Modell here says something safe, then I believe him. He cares about his students. Welcome to Horizon High. The show is really about teamwork. Wow, that fur in your ears must be thick. I said I didn't want to feel that again. Spider-Man, aim for Clayton's chest plate. You don't have to have superpowers in order to stand up and, and fight. Spider-Man, hang on! Though you have all the problems of day-to-day -day life, you can count on your family and your friends and your teachers and your own moral compass to guide you through all of life's problems. Thanks for being an important friend. I hope that people take away from this show that everybody is a hero. Eat water cannon, fuzzball! Although technically it should be drink water cannon! It hits all the right notes. It's thrilling and funny and adventurous and I'm so excited for people to see it.